Greetings and welcome, Sweeney Dunstan here, and today we're going to be learning how to locate and collect bees in Minecraft Java Edition. So if you enjoy Minecraft tutorials, gameplay, and all kinds of other Minecraft related content, subscribe and click that bell so you don't miss another video. The new Minecraft Bees update has definitely caused a buzz lately, and with good reason. It provides honey and honeycomb. As well as being able to be made out of the honey, we have the honey block, and the honeycomb, we can make the honeycomb block. Of course, the honeycomb block is purely aesthetic, and the slime block does have some very interesting mechanics. It's similar to a slime block, but it does not stick to a slime block, so that's going to make for some very interesting redstone builds. This video is being recorded in Snapshot 19W42A, and things may change, so keep that in mind. However, the best way to find bees for now is to go out and find yourself a flower forest. Now this right here is not considered a flower forest, but if we go over this way, we actually have one nearby. Now you may have to travel pretty far distances to find one of these, but once you do, you've hit the jackpot, because more than likely, you are going to find some bees and at least one bee's nest in these areas. Let me look around for a second and see if I can find one. Aha, there it is, right under here. Now there should be one or two bees around here as well, but I'm not sure where they are. So we're gonna wait around for a moment, and as we can see, this one is full of honey. Up oh, there's the bee right there. We're gonna wait until he goes back inside the bee nest, and then we're going to go into survival mode with a silk touch ax and grab that thing up. Okay, so we do currently have a couple of bees inside the bee's nest, so let's go ahead and grab that thing up, just like that with the silk touch pick. May have to break a block or two. Uh-oh. Yep, we're in trouble. So now that we've got the nest with the silk touch pick, we need to run because the bees will be after us. But once we get out of range, we should be fine. And of course, if we get far enough away from that, we're fine. But we can also place down the bee's nest. It is still full of honey. And now the bees will come out and start doing the business right here where we put it. We can actually hear the bees inside. But now I'm going to go ahead and grab out the honeycomb. And as we see, we've got the bees coming out very angry. And of course, all we have to do to keep them from getting aggro is put a campfire right underneath here. The smoke will come up into here and calm them down. That's it for this one. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and click that notification bell so YouTube lets you know when the next video comes out. But until next time, I am Sweeney Dunstan, and I'm out of here. Stay positive, my friend.